If you're looking for a way to resize all your images at once, you can do this in Photoshop. I'm gonna show you exactly what you need to do to resize all your images at once using Adobe Photoshop. Now let's go into Photoshop. Here I'm at the starting screen and let's say I wanna resize all these images in this folder at once. If you look at the image size, it's 4,000 by 5,000 pixels. And let's say I wanna make them 1,000 pixels. So let's first open up this photo in Photoshop. And what we actually have to do is we need to create an action. And with actions in Photoshop, you can basically just tell Photoshop what you are doing and it's gonna remember it and it's gonna apply that to every other photo you select. So let's first go to window and select actions. And here we are at the action panel. Now, what we need to do is we need to create a new action. So let's create a new folder and let's say we name this example video. And then I'm gonna create a new action inside this folder and let's say I'm gonna name it resize. Then I'm gonna click on record and it's instantly recording my action. Now, because I have this photo already opened up in Photoshop, I'm gonna go to image and I'm gonna select image size. And here we can change the size of the image. Right now it's 4,000 by 5,000 pixels. And let's say I wanna make it 1,000 pixels height. And here I will select by cubic sharper because that's the best option for making images smaller to get the best possible quality. Then I'm gonna click on okay and it's resized. The next step is to save it. So I'm gonna go to file and I'm gonna click on save as copy. And here I will select a new folder where I'll save this. Now the folder where we apply this doesn't really matter because we will select the folder later where we want to export all the images at once. So let's just say I'm gonna select the export folder here and here you can select a different file format for your image. I'm gonna keep it at JPEG, then I'm gonna click on save and here we can set the quality of the image. Let's keep it at maximum and click OK. Now you can see here we have image size and save. And that's actually the only steps we need to tell Photoshop to do. Then we're gonna click on stop. So it's gonna stop recording this action. The next step is to apply this action to a bunch of photos at once. And the best way to do this is to use batch. Inside Photoshop, I'm gonna go to file, automate and select batch. And with batch, we can batch process our action. Now here we have to select the set. So this is the folder I created. And here we select the action. This is the action for the resize I just created. In the source, we will select the folder of the images that we want to process. You can see here, this is the folder. I'm gonna change this. I wanna select images because here I have all my images that I want to resize. Then I'm gonna click on choose. Let's disable this one and suppress file and suppress color warnings. We don't need any warnings. In the destination, we will select a folder where we want to save this. So let's choose a folder. I'm gonna go for this folder here, export. And this one we need to keep checked because if we're gonna uncheck this, Photoshop is gonna ask us to save this image every time it's gonna save an image. We don't want Photoshop to ask us to save the image. We just want to process this automatically. So let's click that one. Let's keep it enabled. And that's pretty much it. And then we're gonna click on OK. And now Photoshop is gonna process all these images at once and we don't have to do anything. So that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching this video and catch you on the next one.